Ay, ano lang yung hona sa dako. So, I mean, pa. Namaste. I've been here for a month. So, today I'm gonna do a review of my current setup for my bike packing in a Napurna circuit. So, here's my current setup. My bike packing journey is now in reality. Ano ba kung so, yeah. dito? Five years ago, I went planning to visit Nepal. And when I found out that Paki Outdoors were gonna do a uh, Napurna circuit when we did it in Bohol as August 2022. Yeah, that's August 2022. I joined them. And I've been here for almost a month now. Um, I recently went to Mount Everest Base Camp and now I'm staying here in, to do a Napurna circuit. Hello, namaste! Very nice. <laughs> What's your bike? Nice. <laughs> Commercial lang. Oh my god, love naman dad. But hindi naman nila ako naintindihan kaya okay lang yun. So, quick background lang. Um, ano po na circuit? It's um, already our fourth day. We're gonna cycle to Torongla. Before Torongla is the highest mountain pass in the world. But right now, it's no longer the highest pass. And the goal in bike packing is to pack light as much as possible. But I am not like that. Um, because as a content creator, I have to carry well, it's soft tap stuff. Tons of tap. Um, this one is different from all our adventure because um, in this part we are gonna cycle to high altitude, so we have to carry more jackets. So thanks, special thanks to Colombia for sponsoring this. I try to speak English as much as possible when I'm not good with grammar. So before I reveal what's inside my bag, um, I'm gonna bike check first. So my current tire is this is Schwalbe Navinik. It's 2.35, and I'm using a WTB rim. I forgot the name of this rim. It's a wide rim that can fit 2.8 tires, and this is 29. Oh my gosh, I forgot how to bike check. Actually, put Tanus armor here to avoid flat on the ride. So we're gonna see if it's really effective. <laughs> no tao, guys. Ayan ako. But they don't understand me. So, my group said I'm using your M6100 1x12. So, I'm using, um, for my break, I'm using M6100. All my groups have it's 1x12. So, it's perfect for trail and off road. So, my hub is Hope. Hope. I forget the name. Yeah, and on the front hub, it's. What's the name of it? Weapon. It's Weapon Hub. And. My spoke, this is Pillar, so I built this bike way back 2020 and I think it's more really effective to bring it abroad because most of our mountains are not really rideable. Oh, seat post, this is, my seat post is Shimano Pro and my saddle is TRK Cell SMP. And my handle for is, um, it's not Jones Loop Bar, but it is an alternative option which is the <laughs> it's been a long time since my last bike. Hi, this is Geo Loop Bar and my stem is 60mm stock ng Trek Marlene Co. My carrier, this is bottle cage here just for backup but I don't really use it. It's kind of dirty so don't do it. Front load, I have my Insta360 X3 which I've been using. So I still have a mount here for, this is a cycling mount which I've been using for a year now and it's really effective. But I decided not to put the pole, especially for off-road, so I just have this, this mount. And for this one, I, I've been recording my ride with the Garmin 540 Solar. So everything, all my gears, I'm gonna put it in the link in the description below. I have a flashlight mount. And for this, I have a loop bar bag from Pack Gear. So this is where I put my remote. So this is my blow remote. And yeah, make sure to zip lock them all. And for this part, I have my stem bag. From the other side, I have my bottle cage. And on this side, I put my lube and another trail food and another bottle. And for this part, this is from Pack Gear. This is X Pack Fabric, so it's good for um, rainy days. So I I put my phone here for easy access and my GoPro yeah so it's important to utilize everything like if you can put frame bag why not right so I have my frame bag from Pack Gear so it's 
really fit to my bag. So I put everything, my tools here. So let's see. So all of my tools, it's from Shimano Pro. So thank you Shimano for sponsoring this. And I have my Decathlon patch kit. Hopefully in Dima flat because we have anti-flat Batanos armor. And I also have this pump from Shimano Pro. This is Pro Tools. So make sure to check their website. And they have shop in Santa Mesa, Manila, New Sigma. So I really love this pump. Like it's like a floor pump that you know, very long. It's very long. Oh my god, my English is so bad. So it's easy to pump and you can also convert it to floor pump. And it's not heavy, it's very lightweight. Yeah. Um, my helmet, mat, um, I've been using this helmet for six months. This is K Plus helmet. I really love this helmet. And so I'm done on this part. So my bag, it's um I use pannier for this because I can fit my unfortunately saddle bag is not applicable on my bike because it's like 29er. So I brought um, a pannier from Ort Leave, so it's all waterproof. Um, this is uh, Ort Leave gravel pack. So it's different from my previous pannier because the previous pannier is kind of heavier. This one is perfect for gravel riding. This one is 4.5 kilos and the other one is 4 kilos. So let's see what's inside. So I have everything in here, my clothes and stuff. So I have the shoulder strap here. So this is, um, I use it sometimes for my action camera. I have this towel from Sea to Summit. This is a um, very lightweight towel. So I put it here. I have sleepers. This is from South Peak. So yeah, thank you so much South Peak for this. I really love that it's perfect for climbing. So I separated my gears. This is more for altitude. Everything in here. This is my toiletries. I didn't buy Ziploc, so better you walk with Ziploc. I'm wearing um, Columbia, so everything I wear for this trip is sponsored by Columbia. Thank you so much, Columbia. From so this is um, down jacket from Columbia. I really love that they have Omni Hit here, so it's really legit. So this is what I'm going to be using for high altitude, like right now, I'm going to wear it later. And right now, I'm also wearing pants from Colombia. So this is another pants. So they have Omni Hit here, and I really like that I tested it already at Snow, and it's really good. Oh, this one. So. I have this rainproof jacket and this one is my outer layer. I was supposed to bring two fork bags but I decided to just bring one because we need to pack it as much as possible. Load here so it's all real food like two kilos. <laughs> I'm not gonna show you what's in there but this is like all my chargers. <laughs> Tons of real food I brought a lot. Yes and charger so i put it in here i don't really bring backpack but i really need to protect my camera um, i've been using a7 IV right now with the gorilla pad which i've been putting here and my audio which is holy land so i really need to protect my gears so it's better to suffer and bring four kilos for the sake of my camera. So this is Low Pro Photosport 24 liters. So I think this is 1.3 kilos. It's kind of heavy, but it's really worth it. It's like the best hiking backpack I've tried before. So I, I'll put the link in the description below. I did a separate review about this. So I just put all my camera gears in here, just my camera and my road. So that's all. Now let's see what's on the other side of my pannier. So this is also our clip gravel pack. This one is kind of messy and more miscellaneous. So I have this. Um, this is sponsored by Tranco. Thank you so much for giving this. So this is an Apurna circuit. So I only brought two long sleeves. So this is my merch. It's also available on Shopee. So, we're every day 
Um, I've, I've been washing this almost every day, so this is my Bike Wonder merch. And it's available in Shopee. This Sea to Summit, so I'm selling this on Shopee. Sea to Summit merch. So it has adventure over comfort. Adventure away, it's at the back. So I'm going to sa Shopee, available na yeah. And this is from Virgil, so this is um, like a tube moss. This one is kind of messy because I just hung it a while ago. And this is uh, my favorite cycling pad. This is Suntik. So this is the only padded, padded shorts. This is the only padded cycling pads that I really trust. I said it already for almost a year of cycling. So I tried different. I tried different padded shorts, but this is the best one. So this is Santik. I bought it at Sportsology. So make sure to drop at North Vertis Trinoma. So I, of course, I have my underwear. I'm not quite sure. Oh, uh, I brought uh, big wipes. So it's almost half now. So it's very heavy from the first part of our adventure. I have Vini, which I bought in every space. Um, I'm gonna use it uh, in the next few days. This is my other power bank. I brought two, but I didn't expect there are tons of tea houses here that there are charger in the kids, so I no longer have to charge. So this is Anchor power bank, and I have four spare batteries of GoPros. Of two spare go two spare drone batteries with charging half. Even though this is waterproof, I always make sure to zip lock them all. And yeah, this is my base layer. So I only brought one um, because I know that you won't be showering. I also have some trail foot in here. I love this bag. Na to. I also have some trail foot in here because um, the higher the elevation, it's gonna be more expensive. So I brought a lot. And namaste. <laughs> I brought uh, like a just in case um, we don't we can hang our clothes. Uh, I bought it in Pokhara. This is like chocoplast because I've noticed that it's going to be expensive in the next few days. I'm going to really need it. I'm going to really need This one, it's all real food. Yeah, that's all. And this one, this is um, Sea Summit. So this is waterproof and like the foldable, but I put all my medicines in here. So I'm not gonna show you what's what's all my medicine, but it's important to bring lip balm, diamox, paracetamol, like iron, vitamin C. Actually, I I drank a lot from this trip. Like I really need medicines. It's really important. So it's you no longer need to bother about the weight because you really need those medicines. Oral hydration, salt citrate. Yeah. So this ends my bike packing gear review for Annapurna Circuit. Hopefully we can make it to Turangula. Hopefully I can make it because it's so heavy. My bike is so heavy and kinusto ko to. So just pray for us and hopefully we can make it. Thank you for watching this video and make sure to like and subscribe and share this with your friends and see you on my next adventure. Bye!